Hello everybody, a warm good morning from Madurai. Uh, yesterday we travelled all the way from Cochin to Madurai via Tekri. Uh, it was a very interesting day. We crossed the Western Ghats and came all over to the plains of Tamil Nadu. Madurai is a very ancient city with the Madurai Meenakshi temple and a lot of other interesting monuments out here. It's, it's got a lot of cultural elements that would excite a traveller in you. I mean, seeing all of those, the Tamilian, the Dravidian kind of culture and, you know, all of those intricate, beautiful aspects of their lifestyle and all are something which is to be witnessed as a discerning, distinct traveller. By the way, uh, in case if you, I mean, if you would want to visit these kind of places where we are traveling, definitely check out the website called as www greenearthtrails.com we are working on this project and you know all of these information that you see in here if you would want to go or do it just let us know through greenearthtrails.com so that we can organize it for you that's it for now it's time for us to move let's head on to chetnad Here we are in the land of Chittiyas. It's called Chittinad. Natakotu Chittiyas were a wealthy business community who lived on the shores of the Bay of Bengal in the south Indian state of Tamil Nadu. They moved to the present day Chittinad due to repetitive cyclones on the shores of the sea. They settled across 74 villages some 100 kilometers east of the ancient city of Madurai. They have a peculiar lifestyle, cuisine, art and architecture. They use their immense wealth to build large multi-story mansions to accommodate their large joint families. You got to come here for real to experience the best of Chetinar. We are about to visit the Atangudi tile making unit which is close to the hotel that we are staying in. Twelve years before it was a dying handcraft. Now after tourism developed in this area, most uh, they are serving good now. They have a good market in Kerala, Karnataka, Tamil Nadu and Pondicherry. And all our hotel people supported them and we all laid in our hotels too. Only thing we should not wear the high tipped shoes or high sharpened edges, tools should not fall on it. Okay. It will get easily scratched. Okay. Rest everything, uh, comparing to ceramic tiles, this get more glaze after usage. Okay, okay. You can see in huge mansions and all today a lot of people use Atamudi tiles to enhance the beauty of the flooring. And this was supposed to be a dying art and it was through tourism found a way to rehabilitate this art form and today it is growing pretty well. It's been a lot of walking after the Atamudi Tile Center. We have come all the way to the Chetnad Palace. By that time, the battery just drained out. And uh, we've walked further. I got the batteries recharged. And now we're going to visit the visit the weaving center. Now, Chetnad is uh, known for some cotton weaving. Uh, so they, the cotton sari, Chetnad cotton sari is pretty known. Uh, even people who come down to this place get a chance to see, visit the weaving center, get to know how the sari has been woven. They have pretty good designs. You might not find a lot of people out here in the streets, but you know, it's kind of a very calm, beautiful, enjoyable evening. 
Life is in the slow lane. The day has come to an end and it's time for me to bid farewell to the whole video story. If you have watched it till here, thank you so much. If you loved it, hit that like button. Consider subscribing if you wish to get updates of future videos and put in your feedbacks and comments in the box below. Once again, thank you so much. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.